Yo, have you seen this new video that was uploaded? It's the LG SPT8 sound expansion kit. You haven't? Okay, I'll actually just uh, screen share it to the screen right now. Give me one second and we can watch it together. Hi, good day guys. My name is Alex with Tips and Tricks on LG's home entertainment within South Africa. Welcome to the... Dude, SPTA. why are you screen sharing? So you know that further, you Chromecast is in a 2024 LG TV and you have a so LG C4. Why are you screen sharing? Wait, for real? How do you actually do that? Hi, good day guys. My name is Alex with Tips and Tricks on LG's home entertainment within South Africa. If there's one thing for sure, do not take a tip out of my acting book because that skit was just so bad. But I hope you guys understood the concept because today's video is all about a Google Chromecast coming into LG's 2024 TV models. We already had Apple AirPlay prior to 2024. So today's purpose is we're going to be talking about Google Chromecast and Apple AirPlay and how you could utilize both services built into the LG 2024 TV models. So without further ado, let's get straight into this video. So let's talk Google Chromecast. Historically, when you wanted to share content onto an LG TV using an Android or a laptop PC is that you needed to use the screen mirroring feature. And this essentially mirrors what is happening onto your device with the LG TV. And what happens when you get a WhatsApp on your Android phone or an email on your laptop that you would like to access? Well, you can't do that if you're sharing content with a group of friends or family. You'd need to end the screen mirror feature, then access your WhatsApp and email. That is the downfall to screen mirror, right? Is that you cannot use your device in private use while screen mirroring. That's where Google Chromecast actually comes into play for Android laptops and PCs. Is that if you want to watch something on a larger TV screen, a LG TV, is that you can use the Google Chromecast feature which will share the content over network onto the LG TV and then you can continue using your laptop and Android device in private use. Let me show you a quick tutorial on how to do this. So what you want to do firstly is make sure that your device is connected to the same internet source as your LG TV. Once that is successful, locate the type of content you want to watch and that you're looking to share onto the LG TV. And then find this icon a service right over here. Click on it and you should find a list of devices available on the same internet source. Behind me is a 77 inch C4 2024 model. I'll click that and immediately it will then send the content directly onto the LG TV. Now we just give it a couple seconds for the content to resume on the LG TV. And there you have it, the same exact video that I was watching on my laptop is now being displayed on the LG TV and you can Chromecast up to 4K resolution. The nice thing now is I can then continue using my device in private use while we have the content being played on the LG TV. Let's move over to Apple AirPlay. So let's move over to Apple AirPlay. Apple AirPlay actually works very similar to Google Chromecast, but for iOS devices like a MacBook or an iPhone. And just like your Google Chromecast, your iPhone or MacBook need to be under the same internet source as the LG TV to share content over the network onto the LG TV. So let me quickly show you how you could do this using an iPhone. So what you want to do is launch the servers, then play the video. Locate the icon similar to how the cast icon looks like for Google. Click that. Then click AirPlay and Bluetooth devices. Once you select that, you'll see that the 77C4 is listed right over here. And you can immediately then cast onto the screen. I can then close YouTube right over here and still have the content being played onto the TV screen. Now, if this is your first time going to be doing this, there will be a code displayed on the LG TV and put that into the 
uh, iPhone and then you'll be able to share the content directly onto the LG TV. Well guys it was a fantastic shooting this video for you and as always I do appreciate if you guys could leave a like, hit that subscribe button or comment down below what video you would like me to shoot next. I do have in the lineup a review on the LG OLED B4 so make sure you guys stick around by hitting that notification button so you can be notified of my future video uploads. As always guys, stay good until the next one.